What's up everybody? Um, as you see, this is either the new channel, you're watching it, or this is the AGO channel. If you're on the AGO channel, I ask you to go into the info box, click the link to my new channel and subscribe there please. Um, and let everyone know that I got a new channel. Everyone that you know um, that used to be subscribed to me when I had Gary Orner um, as my channel. Now it's Gary E. Orner. I just put my middle initial in there. I couldn't get the Gary Orner channel back. YouTube is not helpful on that part. Um, but someone broke into my channel and deleted all my videos. Uh, it had to be someone that know, knew who I was and because they emailed my buddy Brian, they emailed a lot of people on my channel and said some nasty things, but that's beside the point. Um, but I am back and we'll be doing uh, videos at least once a week. Um, if not more, I'll do little update videos and blah 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 during the week, but I'm going to try to do something at least once a week. Um, in my videos I'm going to have little segments of like um, snake overload like I used to do. I might try to do like a two minute clip or something for snake overload. Pick out something, talk about it, and go from there. Um, and other stuff you're going to see from here, you guys are going to see the breeding projects I got going on. I got some Nicaraguan stuff happening. Um, I believe I got one grabbing Nicaraguan already, which is really exciting. Um, here we got some boas breeding and stuff like that. We think we got an orange tail ghost already gravid um, at the beginning stages. That's going to be pretty cool. And I'm going to be breeding the matlocks this year. We're going to be breeding uh, some different types of milk snakes this year. So everything's going to be happening. You guys are going to see some eggs. You guys are going to see some breeding. You guys are going to see some you know, babies. And of course I'm going to still do the leopard geckos. Um, I should be producing close to maybe 500 to 800 leopard geckos. It just matters on what other females I get during the year. But if I keep what I just have, um, it, we're looking about 500 babies. Um, roughly, give or take a little bit. Uh, let's see, what else is going on? Not much of anything else, but on this clip we're going to show you some video of some animals to get that in here too, and um, just be on the lookout for some stuff. Also, I'm going to be uploading on Facebook from now on too. Facebook videos are going to be a little bit different because i got a little bit more freedom on Facebook, but in general, if you want to see stuff, I'm going to be releasing stuff on my Facebook too. Um, if you want to become my friend, please just go there, request it. And maybe even shoot me an email because if I don't know who it is and it doesn't look like a, a person on Facebook, I will not okay it. If it's just like, but if you email me and say, hey, this is my screen name, I request you on Facebook, I'll okay you. Um, I just don't want to get into the bots. I want real people being my friends. I don't want the bots being my friends. On Facebook, it's not really bad anyway. So, guys, check out some of my animals I'm going to show you. Um, you guys have seen many of them before, and I'll check you guys later. 100% head. VPI Xanthic. Um, I'm not totally sure what we're going to do with this girl yet. Um, I was thinking Xanthic uh, spiders or maybe even Xanthic pinstripes. Um, I got to talk to my buddy Brian, see what he's got available for me, and go from there. Um, I'm not going to push this girl this year, even though I probably could get her up to weight and breed her a little bit late. I would rather wait that one year. Um, some people like breeding 1,000 gram animals. I'm not one of them unless the animal is four or five years old and it's an old thousand eleven hundred grams. This girl here is only two. So she's got a lot of plans for me. It's just a hat, but hey, I had to start over with some stuff and this is it. Alright guys. Here is not gonna show its head. It's a male. Um, that's all I'm gonna say about it. But uh the color doesn't pick up too well on this camera, but let's just say that when these babies are out and I release them, people are going to want them. Pretty cool. Dump his water. Figures. Um, this here is a Nicaraguan. Everyone asked me on my old channel what it was. Um, I'm still not really going to release too much about it. Um, he has bread. He is very aggressive. Um, but uh, he's already got with one girl. She ovulated. I'm going to put him back in again just to make sure that, you know, job's done. Then we're going to go ahead and put him in with the red Nicaraguan. So, a very exciting project to me. I love this snake. And I can't wait to see I'm what it produces. dumping their water. So I got to clean up some of this stuff. As you guys see, you can see the water spot. They dumped their water. I had water in there. This is a ghost and a cinnamon. 
I like this cinnamon and I actually like it a lot. And this is a ghost. Um, the cinnamon's ready to breed. The ghost has not produced plugs yet, but guess what? It, it'll go this year. I know it will. Pretty cool. Um, these are the only two in my whole room that's housed together. The only two animals. But I ran out of 28s for them and I gotta get a, a couple more 28 quarts. Maybe another 28 quarts. Another one dumped his water. What I'll do is I'll do, have to go through these today and make sure they got water. Um, this here is a 100% HET T positive male, Nicaraguan. He's breedable. He does produce um, sperm plugs. I have not had him with a female yet. Um, I have to get females big enough. So it's going to be fun. Yeah, look at my floor. Aspen. Yay. Pretty cool. One of my favorite animals right here. In closing, I want you guys to know, you guys are either on the new channel, which is Gary E. Orner, or you're on the old channel, AGO. Now, if you're on the AGO channel, click in the info box, get your butt over to Gary E. Orner's channel. Um, I'm switching up the channels. I don't want to get into why, but uh, I'm going to be updating the Gary E. Orner channels. And I'm also going to be uploading on Facebook. I'm going to actually start a blog also. Where I'm going to talk about everyday happenings, everyday reptile stuff. I'm going to actually get that going. Um, you guys are going to see a lot of new stuff from me. And the radio show is back back strong. I'm going to be doing the first show this Friday night at 9 p.m. That's where I'm looking to do it right now. Um, hopefully everything goes good for that. Uh, but it's only going to be like a half hour show. Just an intro. And um, I'm going to look at next week and get it going. Probably a bi-weekly or weekly show. I'm not totally sure. But um, we'll get that going. The radio show is coming back. I think I'm just going to bring it under my, my name. Because I want to talk about other things. I don't want to just talk about reptiles. I might talk about cricket breeding. I might talk about uh, going to a zoo. Who knows what I'm going to talk about. So have some fun, guys. Subscribe to my channel. I never asked that before, but let's have some fun. I had a lot of subscribers before. I'm gonna I'll be uploading on Facebook. I'm gonna have a blog, and be on the lookout for Gary's new website for you, so you guys can buy animals off Gary Warner. All right, guys, I'm out.